what's your most challenging role and why that you played as an actor? I think the most challenging role was lockdown. Hmm. That I played as an actor because the character that I portrayed at the, you know, he was a first time felon, never been to jail. Uh, wasn't no street kid, wind up getting, you know, raped and, mm. uh, put through a lot of things, shooting hair on. I've never done any of that. So I had no, um, nothing to, I fall back on to help me to reach those emotions or things like that. So I just utilize movies I saw blood in, blood out, things like that when characters were getting raped or had to go through shooting hair around, how would they act? I never I w I never done that, so I wouldn't know. But just reminiscing on things that I've saw, other actors that I saw portray characters like that, shooting hair around or getting high, I just went in myself and let it out, you know, tapped into that. But that was the most. And then there was a scene in there uh, in lockdown where the character uh, Dre had to give the white boy head. So, yeah, man, that was, that was like the toughest uh, part I've ever had to play because I didn't see no, mm. no, like, why? Why does he have to get his man? And if it was me, I would have, in real life, I don't care if you're a punk, pussy, whatever. You put it in my mouth, I'm going to bite that mother off. <laughs> you're not getting it back. There's many ways that, that you could have you could have survived that and been Pause, no but, shame and no damn. Yeah, nah, but, for real. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that shit really affected me. And, um, mm. You know, I, I never would do no shit like that again. I know mm. I, I had a weeds. They had a part for weeds from a TV show called Weeds, and the character they wanted me to play uh, was getting hit from a dude in the car, and the police come up and hit on the window, and the dude bite his penis off in in the in the in the in the shock of shit. So you see mm. that go to show you, you know, you don't, you don't, it's crazy, bro. But I turned that role. I'm good. I don't, I don't give a fuck how much they can. <laughs> I don't, I'm not doing nothing like that. No, mm. you know, hearing you say this, you know, we've heard, we've heard of actors in the past, right? You know, some are method mm -hmm. actors. You know, is there a risk of getting too deep into the character and losing yourself mm. when, you know, playing these roles? Um, I think, yeah, I mean, because you're dealing with energy, man, you're dealing with thought and then you embodying something. So just like, you know, they say life imitating art. I got shot um, in like 98, 98, 97. Mm. I got shot three times. But before I got shot, I did a movie called Three Strikes. And in the movie, my character wanted to get shot in the ass. And in reality, when I was uh got shot, one of the bullets was in my ass. Damn. So, so it was crazy. Right after I did that movie, I wound up getting shot. I played in lockdown where my character had to stab the dude. And um for the dude that was raping him and doing all mm -hmm. that. So Finally got fed up, he stabbed him, and the dude died. He got killed. But in reality, I wind up catching a, 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 a manslaughter from stabbing someone for defending myself and winding up, you know, going to jail, prison for that shit. I did nine years, seven months. But, wow. you know, life imitating art, that type of energy. I said, next time, I'm just going to play a billionaire, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck that, Facts. Man. MREC TV. This DeAndre Barnes interview is sponsored by the MREC and RIP show. Subscribe to the channel on YouTube. The links is in the descriptions and the comment below. And also, you subscribers going to get you a chance to win money, prizes, gift cards. All right? We got a raffle coming. 
Yo, what's going on? It's DeAndre Bond. Yeah. Shout out to Forgotten Kings TV, man. M Rec TV. I appreciate y'all for having me on. Yo, what's going on? It's DeAndre Bond. Yeah. Shout out to Forgotten Kings TV, man. M Rec TV. I appreciate y'all for having me on. This DeAndre Bond's interview is sponsored by the M Rec and Rip Show. Subscribe to the channel on youtube the links is in the descriptions and the comment below and also you subscribers gonna get your chance to win money prizes gift cards all right we got a raffle coming so lock in subscribe to the m rec and rip show the link is in the description and it's right on youtube gone Spooky Hours, the movie called Nobody Knew. <laughs> Download this new thriller. The link is in the description and the comment below. And it's only on SpookyHoursTV.tv. Peace. MREC TV. Yo, what's going on? It's DeAndre Bonds.